Hello everybody, welcome back to Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I don't know what's going on, but again, we can press continue. I don't know what that's for. I end my runs at every recording. Or end my recording at the end of a run, however you like to see it. So we'll just ignore it for this once. Um, Eve needs a kill there. So do you. You need to go to Shul still. Oh, we're almost done, actually. Except for that lost. Let's go with Eve again. And we need to go to the cathedral. Like I said, I don't hate Eve, but the first two floors are key to our success, I would say. Or his success, depending on how interested you are in the actual storyline. At least how you tend to interpret it. I don't know, man. It's kind of a weird tale on this one, right? Anyway. I'm just here to play a good game. He's gonna not blow himself up. And I'm gonna have to deal with the spiders that he throws out. Which is great. Just freaking great. Man, leap on those spiders. Ouija board. Hmm. Hmm. Would help me in this room, but it's a bit too late now. Okay, spiders can jump 500 feet, so just be careful. Oh, there's a marked rock. Fortunately, we do not have a bomb. Are these the exploding ones? No. Curse of the... Maze is doing its thing again. I would really like a bomb, actually. Not like that, though. Yeah. How about a bomb for a drop, then? Well, we tried. Probably go... Well, there's more bombs. More explosions, at least. I don't see any marked rocks to the side here, so we might as well. Now we really have to start being careful. Uh, this would allow me to go into that curse room, and I see no reason why not to go straight away. That's one reason, I suppose. Uh, I hate Curse of the Maze because of things. Well, someone pointed out that it can actually open up shop doors without having you to use a key, but. The benefits of Curse of the Maze are not nearly as valuable as the downsides are detrimental to you. So. Same with uh, Excel floors. When you lose on a shop, you most of the time you lose out on a deal with the devil. Well, there's a bomb. And a spaceball item for that matter. So you might as well take it. I hope I can still hit mm, rocks with that now, because I got... Well, there's two normal bombs, just in case it doesn't go well. Alright, let's try to get in here again. Okay, good. Well, got a spirit heart out of it. Well, half one. Alright, where did we see that marked thing? Not here. Was it here? Yeah, there it is. I'll use this first so I know how it handles with. Yep. Thought that would have been the case. Wow, really? I don't even have a key. Alright, well, at least we gotta have a spirit art. That should keep us for life for a little bit. Fighting the widow again. At least it's not the... What's it called again? Haunt? Yeah, the haunt. You can see it's early. That's when uh, I tend to do my recordings. Okay, there goes the spirit hearts. Well, that means we can get hit. 
on the next floor will be in some serious problems. Synth oil has great damage in range. Uh, no key. Not enough money for our shop. Let's just go. Alright, so Bob's round ahead has become a little bit more useless, I would say. Well, it depends. It's supposed to be used differently now. Let's just put it like that. The so spiders can jump stupendously far. It's never a good thing. So that means the Bob. Oh no, I picked that up. Ah, oh, shite. Oh well. Let's try to make it to our boss then. I hope I hit that. Yeah, I did. Okay. I was not supposed to pick up that health. At least Synthoil gets us out of the way of low, low, low damage. Need a key for that. Get out of here, spider. Man, we did that thing three times or something. Okay, there's a bomb, but I don't need a bomb, I need a key. Okay, we're probably gonna get hit here. Bob's brain is not yet ready, could have probably misused it here. And I do not like spiders. Oh crap, now they both broke. Hmm. A bit of luck will find our boss room pretty quickly on 11. Sort of an easy time killing it. So we either get the haunt, or pin, or one of the special bosses. That's good. Maybe we can chuck the head against him. Probably want to get the uh, little dude killed first because he could be a bit of a problem. Okay, that's a hit. Did a good deal of damage too. Now, a one deal with the devil, one hard deal with the devil. And eh, that could be a two deal. Another razor. Well, we don't know if this is going to stick around, so we'll take those. Uh, which means we'll be out of Horror Babylon for quite a while then. Unless there's an arcade here, which I don't think we'll have. Is there another way of getting rid of red arts? Yes, a demon judgment, and that was stupid. I don't know why I was just standing there. Going to be an interesting run again then, huh? This is not how I want to play as Eve with. That should be more than clear. As far as secret room goes, I can only see one good space for it. We'll have to use a normal bomb because the bomb range is not ready yet, and it would. Mm, it can even be there. Huh. That means it could be practically in a number of places, which means I will just ignore it. Does this blow up a pot? I don't think it does, right? Well, I can shoot over the pots. No. But we can see if there's something special. Nope. Okay, then we're leaving. No more crocs here. So now I have a bit of an issue, um, it'll be <coughs> up until Caves 2 for another chance to deal with the devil, and chances are it's going to be a deal with the angel, and chances are it's going to pay out with nothing actually useful. <coughs> How's that for uh, seeing things in a bright light, huh? Mm. A bit of a... Distant thing. It's 
what's it called? Prediction. But we'll see if I'm right. You're gonna drop health now? I've seen him drop his item more than once in this type of deal. Nope, just red arts. Okay. Bountiful color of enemies. Man, we're doing next to no damage. But we're not getting hit either. Why did I just say that we're not getting hit? That'll get to nowhere. Alright, so we need a key. The Joker card would go a long way, but like I said, we're probably stuck for deals with the Angel right now. <coughs> then again, we're only going to the Cathedral, so... Ah, the right. Well, killed everything. No key. Not that surprised. Hope we just get at least one on this entire floor. Because apparently, having no keys is not where the difficulty of hard mode should be coming from. So, yes, I'm kind of waiting for my key now. That's a bomb. Okay, come on. Key, please. Not a pill could be bombs or key, but could also be arranged down. This is only gonna take forever. Can I get this thing to sort of work? Uh, yeah, but it's gonna take forever again. I suppose I could stand here. There you go. Can I shoot him up? No, shooting them up the spikes here only makes it worse for you, doesn't it? Yeah, because I think they just don't pop up anymore then. It used to kill them, even when they were uh, down, but uh, not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, we hit him with the bomb, that's something. Damage is so bad. That's what you get with Eve. <clears throat> That's usually not what I get when I'm playing as Eve. Stupid deal with the devil giving me stupid razor blade that I can't stupid do anything with. Uh. I mean, if it were only to take red hearts, then yeah, razor blade would have been fine, but if it takes black hearts and spirit hearts first, then not really, huh? Well, we're almost done here, it seems, so... We'll get to do another floor... ...like this, where we hopefully find an arcade where I can then give away my red hearts. All of them, hopefully, that it doesn't blow out when I have one and a half left. I know it can happen. More damage. It's always convenient. So now we just need a key. And with not many more rooms to go to, it's starting to look grimmer and grimmer to actually get them. We can always go to our... Oh, kind of have to, right? Okay, what you got? Ah, there we go. Key. I'm not going in there because that'll give away my last of my spirit hearts. Let's see if we can... There we go, we can just bomb in. Mini mush, cool. Pentagram, wow. Well, this is gonna be great for when we do end up in uh, Horror Babylon. I'm still going to try and do that. Just feel like that's the only way you're meant to play as Eve. And that's with Horror Babylon kicking it every time. 
Now, where was our item room? I think it was up there somewhere. Was that the way to our boss room? I think that was it, yeah. I still believe it was up somewhere. So maybe here somewhere. Yeah. Chocolate milk. Uh, sure. Not a big fan of chocolate milk, but hey, we gotta try them out every once in a while as well, right? Keeps things interesting. We can always shoot them uh, like it's soy milk. Man, that would be crazy. Chocolate milk plus soy milk. Your fingers will be sore after that one. What did we just kill him in one hit or did he walk onto something? Oh man, we killed him in one go. Let's check for marked rocks. Oh, there's still a dude left. Let's take care of him first. And that means we have some fairly decent tears. Or a Babylon's gonna be sweet. Yeah, just go walk straight towards the flying bone. That's uh, that's the way to survive in this game. Walk towards the bullets. I got no idea where health is. Capcorn, all stats up. That means health and damage range. Luck. But, does it upgrade your faith, or does it upgrade your evil, or are both stats de un independent from one another? Dun, 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 dun. The plot thickens, although there's probably someone out there that already knows the answer. Again, for all we know, an all stats sub can just be tears, damage, health. And rate of fire. Maybe shot speed as well. And we just give up on the evil, holy, and plain luck stat altogether. Who knows? And who can be bothered to answer? Hmm. Oh, it's interesting with the chocolate milk, though. I'll give you that. Um, you could still potentially find an arcade. It's looking a bit more towards no, though. Well, we're not done yet. Let's go beat our boss first. Gotta deal with the angel. And, uh, Mega fatty. But it doesn't really matter how we feel, it's just gonna be a bit louder on your end when I'm uh, mashing my firing button. Now that's almost the same speed as chocolate milk, right? Maybe half of it? But again, chocolate milk does fire pretty darn quick, doesn't it? Yeah, we got hit, but oh, uh, we got hit again. That's not very well played, is it? We didn't even get it. Oh, and I hate getting tears up when I'm using chocolate milk. Although it does seem to speed up the rate of which we. Why did I pick that up? Ah, oh, I'm an idiot. Mm. Wow. Well, at least I realized this fairly quickly. So, we want to go look for another hematomesis pill then. Oh, we're doing quite well though, all things considered. Still looking for that arcade though. I, mean, I don't know if it's the same rules that it used to be. I'd be kind of surprised if it were, but hey. Man can dream, right? We're not sh one shotting those, but sh sh we do one shot. And the other, yeah, there we go. Take care of it like that, huh? 
It's a good thing we're not going for boss rush, because damn, we would never make that anymore. Wow, that was shot coming out of the blue. And hitting as well. Can't say I'm too happy with that stuff. Almost said a bad word again. Where is that final dude? Come on. That's not the last one, is it? Yeah, it is. That's Himitimesis. Uh, we we'll might as well look for an arcade first before we do some weird stuff with that. Um, going into our shop would be bad. There might be a spirit heart on sale. Or maybe just a spirit heart for purchase. Uh, so we'll use Himitimesis, and in theory that should bring us into Horror Babylon, which it did. We now have an even bigger tier, and we'll get one of those as well. Broken stopwatch isn't bad, but we're now at the point where I would like to be at. Oh. Sorry about that. That was uh, the hiccups. Apparently a great way to get rid of those is uh, trying to force one. Well, not trying to force up a hiccup, if you know what I mean. I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. Two rooms, one, two, three, four, five locations, six if you count that one. I will check this one out because it would be tremendously convenient if it were there. There we go. What do we have in here? A troll bomb. Well, they can't all be winners, but still appreciative of the fact that they allowed me to go in there without taking damage. And I picked one up again. Why, 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 why? I really need to get rid of my red hearts. Seriously. <sighs> so we didn't get a deal here. I'm wondering why that is. I didn't think I took red heart damage. Oh, maybe we'll get one here. I see which Mises count, but we took that pill after beating the boss, so mm, weird things and such. Seemed like a good choice at the time. Seemed to pay it out of the well, so we can't complain too much, can we? Come on. Machine gun fire! My way I'll use that on a room that has a bunch of consumables in, right? Oh, well, that's lucky find. Uh, greed here means you're not in our shop, which means I will be heading towards that shop. Should really try to find out what. Oh, wow, that's a lot of cash. Can do a lot of stuff with that money. Uh, I suppose it would have been a great room to use that room on as well, but. Meh. Yeah. I think I'm pretty much done with the pills around the back now. Got a lot of HP to trade away if I ever get the option to. A lot of it. Careful there. This is not the mom floor, which means we can beat our boss if we find it. We didn't, but that's our item when we done. I should really check how long it takes for me to completely charge up that shot. It seems to go pretty quickly though. Ah, why not? Why I just add to the insanity. BBF. One of those items that can quickly get you killed, but can also really help you out if you let it. 
Uh, yeah, I don't see a reason why not to pick this up and use it straight away. It's been a while since I actually got items out of this, but hey. These might as be even more valuable. So we're still looking for an arcade. We got definitely got the money for it, but... Uh, or a blood bank in the wild, that's fine too. Um, well, that's big beautiful fly doing its work again. More red hearts. Not interested in those. Not interested in those. Hmm. Well, if Big Blue Fafai ends up hitting something, it's probably gonna be me with. Uh, no, it didn't. Let's go take that out now that it's singled out. There we go. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Kill him. Do something good. Yeah, depth one. We can do this. The cage. Huh. So this is where you're can be a normal boss. I thought you would have been more wound material. Because you're kind of annoying. I suppose you're a bit easier on... Uh, well, we're not dealing with... Oh, jeez, multiple of you. Alright, so... Um, things I can expect. So, we've gotta deal with the angel waiting for us where we won't be able to get rid of our red hearts and then on the womb we'll either get another deal with the angel or fight Krampus. How's that for? Yeah, okay, so deal with the angel so I was right on that. I was also right on the fact that it would have been useless. Um, so what's left then? Well, an arcade. But, seeing how well I am staying away from red hearts, it's probably not going to last us for too long. But still, we could try. Um, gotta love it when uh, those long distance guesses pan out, right? Just, is this ever going to be useful? I mean... No, right? No. I suppose one thing is by going with high red hearts is that the two of hearts card will be usable. Stone ones, well, uh, deep, uh, aren't we fancy? Alright, well, there's another chance for us to be able to bomb. Oh, no, we already found our secret room, so that's a no, no, no. No arcade either. I suppose those got uh, wiped out of existence alongside of useful deal with the devil rooms. Go figure. I'll donate some money here, I suppose. Uh, is there a room that has stuff in it? Mm. Do you know what this pill does? Range down. Alright, so we'll re roll the range down. Into. Nothing. Is that not what that does? Change. What could. Ch that could have been an. Could have been. Like a, like the D6 that I re rolled an item rather than a consumable. <laughs> well, we were. Let's say content with the item from a item room. So, uh, shop had a greed fight in it, did it not? Or was that in the. No, it was not a greed fight. Um, yeah, we'll donate. We'll see if we can keep 15 cents if the donation machine doesn't blow up beforehand. And it does. Oh, we got 7 cents donated towards the good cause. So at least it wasn't a complete waste. Let's open this because reasons. Oh, Cuppy's head isn't bad. Let's take that. Put a bomb here. 
You might say, well, you might as well use Bob's round head for it. No, because that wouldn't have hit the chest. And it would have flowed straight through the walls as well, so... I'm kind of wondering how my flies act with um, chocolate milk. Is it standard damage that they would do without me having chocolate milk, or... How does that work? I suppose it's gonna be standard damage, right? Average. The normal. Doing some good work. Haven't been hit by it yet. Still looking for that elusive arcade as well. Alright, so the one that's trans. Oh, he can be killed. I thought I had to kill him last. Alright. Well, let's start killing the other ones then. We'll, uh,. Try to use Guppy's head at the end because I don't think they'll be of too much use on these. F yeah, look at them. Uh, well, they did kill one. Let's open it. Ooh, flight and another HP up. Unless I come across an arcade. But then again, we haven't seen any of those so far, so why would we suddenly do start seeing them? Maybe because now I have to contemplate on whether it's a good idea to use him or not. Hmm. Was worth a try. Good stuff here. Let's see if it's here. Oh. Alright, well we tried. Uh, can I just kill these without a problem? Could even let uh, BBF do some work, but why wait for him? Can't shoot through the fire, maybe that's why I would wait for BFF. There we go. Okay, let's see what we have in here. The skulls, that is. A turret. That's what we get. A turret. There's an item room. A final one, if I'm not mistaken. Polyph... Polyphemus. Poly polyph... Polyph... Wow, that's a big tier. Now quickly do I get that? Pretty slow, but if I... This could work. It's gonna be weird. And we'll make it work. Damn. Yeah, this is... Yeah, I think we can make this work. Um, do we have... No, we shouldn't have green here. No, we don't. Uh, we have options. Does it even help us at this point? No, no, we'll see. We don't really need the key for anything. Let's move on. Mm, troll bomber, huh? of course. Why wouldn't you blow yourself up? I just funded your suicide. Now you're making me feel like a dick. Pills. Are you a wizard? So now I got gigantic tears that fly off completely the wrong way. There's another hematomesis pill, which we'll use. Yeah, we'll use it right now. Get back into Horror Babylon. See if that changes anything. Even, even bigger tears! Uh, no, we're still shooting. Looks like we got bigger tears. Okay, now we're shooting to it. There we go. And now we need to fire like that. There we go. Starting to get the hang of this. Now it's over. Thank God. This is the mom fight. We'll take Ghost Baby for free. Might as well blow these calls up then. For another turret. Alright, so we'll leave the hearts unless we find an arcade, and even then we might not want to use it. I don't think there's going to be anything up there, so let's just ignore that. We almost one shot a mini boss. Hmm. 
Temperance, huh? You know what? I'll hold that with me. We can always use it to get some health out of it too by blowing it up, I suppose. Might as well check what's in here, right? It's not gonna hurt anyone. And it... Yeah! Sure, double the rate of fire if that's still what that item does. Um, Alright. So we're kind of playing the... What was it called? There was a challenge like this, right? What, what, what was it called? High road? No. Glass cannon was not it either, because that was with the epic fetus thing. Uh, I don't know anymore. Well, if it's not a boss, we'll probably one-shotting it. Okay, our deal with the devil, the, uh, deal with the angel. We want the Polaroid. Scapular. Alright. We can't leave here, so we'll grab another HP up. Now what I could do here is wait until I find a... a half a red heart. And then plop the blood bank down. So we can go to Polaroid Invincibility. Or make use of it at least, if you have to. That's a boss, we're not one-shotting that. We're not that far from it, though. Come on, half a red heart. Half a red heart. Nope. That's going pretty quickly here. With them not being able to jump on me, it really goes a lot better. I'm assuming uh, BFF already took one or two out and it's giant explosion. Ah, there's a half heart. Alright, Temperance, use it. Grab it, use it. I mean, we've got Polar Invisibility now, but does it really help us out with more money? Not really. Alright. So Polar Road should now activate every time we get a hit. So it's either that or be able to get hit a lot six more times. I don't know. It's an interesting conundrum. But being able to do that is kind of neat though. Maybe we'll get another deal. No, you won't because we just got one. Yeah, that's how that works, right? If you get one on floor A, you won't get one on the next one unless you have God's Head book. God's Head again. I'm gonna keep saying that, aren't I? Goat's Head, Book of Belial, Joker card, or a random teleport towards it. I don't know if you can actually get that. Hmm. Yeah, I thought that was gonna happen. Well, let's pull away invisibility for you. Where are we going? Well, hopefully towards our boss. So in theory our fly should become death as well now, because of Polyphemus upping our damage quite a decent amount. We've been here before. Where are we supposed to go then? Uh, well, let's open. Ah, and then there's... Oh no, that's the one I plopped down. Right. That rerolls everything. So I'm saying no thank you. Well, it rolls all of our items. And I don't want that to... Uh, wow, look at that. That was beautiful. Alright, so we might as well decide now. Do we want Polaroid invisibility or do we want to be able to take more hits whilst doing less damage ourselves? Mm. Man. Hitting Conquest as hard as we're doing right now really eases that choice for us. Alright, good. 
or evil, although you can't tell us because we're nice pink and fleshy with a set of angel wings to us. But wow, we one shot at a gurgling. Eat it! And we still had damage to spare because Polyphemus just went straight through. Oh, there's another blood bank. I think if we keep our wits about us and we don't end up doing the entire floor just like we are accustomed to, then there's a good chance we'll uh, win here. Second time we can't see our map. Doesn't really matter too much, especially not here. Uh, Hematomesis, yeah, we'll keep that pill in case we start losing our health. So that makes the choice easier to bring our HP up or it'll keep it low. We can now amp it up when needed. At least we got something for our trouble there. Even if it was just one cent that you'll never use. And again, we didn't pay any keys to get in there in the first place. Uh, there's a beggar for us. Come on, don't drop a troll bomb. Compass would be great. I'd rather not have you drop an HP up. Or red hearts, because then it means I would have to stop playing. Yeah? That's a bomb. And that's one that isn't lit. I don't care, man. You can take all of my money. Compass would be great. Map would be cool, too. Alright, well, that's just weird right now. Uh, let's go to our secret room. Cool. No idea where we are. Uh, that particular direction? Yeah, well, well, we haven't been here yet. That's for damn sure. Ghost baby. Ah, that I blame Ghost baby for that one. You should not be hitting him. Up. Nope. That's the double room. So down to the right then. Uh, yeah, there we go. Right, grab that back. We we'll want that. Surprised by that, actually. Well, there's a goat head. Right in time for us to be completely useless unless we can get something on the cathedral, which I'm also not completely sure of. Also, did you notice that I actually said goat head for once? Enjoy it. It's not gonna last. I guarantee it. Cool. Totally worth it to come here. Can't pick that up yet, but maybe when we're done with the boss. Just trying to find more money. Judgment must be close to paying out, unless it's also a fixed chance that he pays out on every coin. Hmm. Alright, don't know what killed him there. Tower, no thank you. Oh yeah, they shoot back. Who knew? Well, everyone did, but uh, now we can at least grab that. We're not gonna blow judgment up. I'm not that big of a douche. He certainly earns it because he did take what twenty-five cents of mine. <laughs> Man, this floor is pretty big, isn't it? <laughs> So the hands can probably land on the acid here. Uh, we've already been to our secret room, but it wasn't anywhere near here. Hermit is a random teleport. Which I could have used to get out of that mob trap room, or boss trap room, or whatever it was. But, doesn't matter. 
he beat the living daylight out of them anyway. Alright, two more cents for judgment. And then we'll be uh, on our merry way, won't we? Uh, don't pick those up. And there's another cent for him. Now where were you? Up here, I believe. Here? There you are. Huh. I think that's one of the few times where I had more than 20 cents where a judgment didn't pay out. No. First time for everything, I suppose. Alright, mom. Or lives, whatever. Decent damage. Alright, enough with the uh, fancy eyes. Can line up the shop, just hold it in for later. Cool. Uh, so this should bring you up to the cathedral, yeah it does, but before we get started with that, let's put some bombs here, maybe we get lucky and at least get one spirit heart back, no! Ah well. Sometimes all you can do is try, and we did, so let's move on. The chub! Let's be careful with our BF here. Big beautiful fly. What a wonderful name for a remarkable item. And that shot. Ooh, noticed that one. Sure. Whoa, that was a big beautiful fly. Finally doing some damage to me. is turning quite sour quite quickly now. But remember we got the hematomesis pill in case things do end up going really, 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 really bad. I hope I don't have to use it. Because we're doing good stuff here. And then again, I'm, if I do have to end up using it, that it pays out with its max potential, if you know what I'm talking about. The actual four hearts rather than just the one. Now the question is, do I want to face Isaac with just two hits capable of killing me. Mm. Well, I'm saying two now, but that could easily change when we get to him. For good or for bad. Uh, there's something in there, which I probably will... Be. Yeah, yeah, there's another one of those right now. Uh, so I want to use... Do we want to go with Book of Belial now? I suppose we could use it for the boss itself. I can go with this for now, I would say. To at least stop the bleeding a little bit. We'll see what happens. You can take comfort in knowing that every six rooms equals one spirit heart. Which isn't a lot, but it's better than... Uh, Having nothing. I would like to believe you know, Kalos isn't really gonna do much for me, but it is a great trinket. We just sh one shot at two greeds with not brimstone. Feels good, man. Feels good. All right, I'm just gonna stay over this rock for now, and you can. Uh, yeah. I picked up a heart, but it doesn't matter. Although, yeah, actually it does for a Polaroid of this ability. Okay. Mm. Sorry, man, I can't be trusted with that stuff. Uh, could use Hemodemesis to get back to that point, but seriously, do I really want to do that? The answer being no. I'll just have to go through it without Polaroid of this ability then. I do want to stay in Horror of Babylon, though. Which will happen as long as I don't pick up another one.
Alright, so now we will go grab uh, the Book of Belial. And really stick it to the boss. We'll come back for our Book of Revelations, then I think it's worth more than Guppy's head. Strangely enough. It's a weird thing to say. I know. Anyway. I think our damage is good enough so we don't need to rely on the flies from Guppy's head. Is probably what I'm trying to get across. Isaac. Meet gigantic tears. Well, the good thing is we can just keep our shots bottled up until we need them. As in as we can get a clear sh Ah, that's... Bullshit and y'all. Man, our tears are even great when we are just tapping the butt. Oh, straight up dead. Uh, I mean, we could keep Book of Belial, but it's probably not in our best interest, right? We can fly and we got the speed, it doesn't take too long. I got him into Mises, which we might as well use straight away once we end up in the chest. Well, in the boss fight. The blue baby fight. Yeah, blue baby fight. We don't have polar road invisibility anyway unless we come across a rogue blood bank. And we won't lose Horror of Babylon when we pick up Red Heart in said room. So it's okay. Man, why is the music here so loud? Money equals power. Crystal ball. I don't think the crystal ball will give us our map. But we might as well give it a shot. And I use the Medivisus. I'm... Ain't I the smartest person alive right now? No, does not give us our map. The sun card is better than the Imitamisa spell, though. Um, so thank you for that. We can at least see our health. I wanted to use the moon card. Trust me, I did. Oh, why do I keep making stupid mistakes like that? Uh, well, there's half of our damage gone. Uh, and then even the sun card didn't give us our map. Those are some hefty mistakes right there, man. I hope it doesn't matter that my skill can overcome my stupidity. Amount of spirit arts. What are you? Nah. All right. Well, that'll give us two spirit arts when we need them. Helps alleviate the pain of the stupidity that just went by at least for a little bit. We have no idea where we are, we can only hope that they placed us closer to the boss room. Hmm. They're quicker than me. Something that doesn't really happen so often, especially because we didn't have any speed downs. And we're playing with Eve. Oh well. Double cage. This is gonna hurt. Could use some bombs, but the chance of them hitting said bombs aren't that great. Trying the reverse psychology trick again, obviously. It's going. What the? How did. 
They can change directions mid-roll? How the hell is that fair? Okay, he hit the big beautiful fly there, so I can understand why that happened. Alright, so we can try to get back into our Babylon state then. Can't say if it's the smart move though. So usually the rooms where you don't want a big beautiful fly, but he blew up far away from us. And there's our boss already. Uh suppose we want the health, right? Alright, so how we do this? Well, I think we grab this. We'll do one more room. Uh, now it doesn't matter anymore, but oh well. Well, it might actually, if you wait to use Book of Revelations until... Uh, if you wait to use Book of Revelations until we get into Horror of Babylon. What is this? The Lovers. Now we'll use the Lovers to get back to full HP. So we'll use Book of Revelation, we'll go down to Horror Babylon, we'll then use the 48 energy to get another two spirit arts. This is all worst case scenario, it could be that I just beat his ass without needing any of it. Alright. E versus three question marks. So the flies can be annoying seeing that our shots are like ginormous. The white ones are the annoying. Uh, well. Dead bird is doing some work though. Yeah, I know. I'm amazed myself. This really wasn't that hard. Made some stupid mistakes along the way, don't get me wrong. I know that. There we go. That should be Eve's posted note filled out as well then. Let's have a look just for peace of mind. Yep, done. Alright, so who do we have left? Samson, Eden, The Lost, Isaac. And that's it. Cool. Alright, well, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to show support by commenting, liking, and or something, and I'll be seeing you guys on the next episode. Bye everyone.